in the next episode of Lamar KX. Okay, I'm definitely going to look into it, but I'm going to get out your way, man. It was nice talking to you. Have a good one. All right. And we are back here. What it is, what it do. It's Lamar KX. And I'm back here with you. What's good, you guys? About to go get some gas. Cruise around a little. Come back. Me and wifey will do a little workout. With the uh, German style helmet. I'm feeling it. Day though. I'm feeling good. My wife didn't have to go to work today. It's a holiday weekend, but some soldiers did have to go to work, so shout out to y'all. Better you than me. You know? A beautiful day today. I thought about going out, but I was like, no, I'm going to stay home and actually save some money. Don't want to blow unnecessary money if I don't have to. Just like with these tires, my goal today is to mess these shits up. And my appointment is at like 1.30 Tuesday. And when I went to the shop the other day, the nigga was like, I'm backed up. So I was like, all right, I'm going to call him at the end of the week see if he got open appointments. And now he said he don't got no more appointments to Tuesday. I'm like, dude, how is that possible? It's not that many people that work there, but still, dude. It's pretty ridiculous if you ask me. Let's get it. Yeah, we're going to hit a different gas station.
I get neutral? Ah, I got it. Beautiful. It's always a good day to get neutral. And I put the heat gun on my paint too. Cause my shit was taking up. Some of my paint kept coming up. So yeah, I'll put some new shit on there. Uh, let's see. Breathe in here. And one of the gas stations my wife told me about said they don't take gas. You gotta uh, pay inside. Cause I guess people were putting gas in and just pulling off without paying. And I'm still trying to figure out how they was doing that. Cause last I checked, you had to pay first. No receipt, don't need that. Uh, it's a dirt white, so it takes 91. I'm trying to think if last time did I put fucking regular in here, but I can't remember. How much y'all think it's gonna take to fill up? Ooh. And I think they're holding my bike is for overflow. I think. There we go, she filled up, I'll take that. I don't want it too hot when I pop Willie's in the gas, spill back on me. $3, now if I was in my Camaro, I'd have been guaranteed putting 30 to 40 bucks in here. Guaranteed. All right, and we're back here. Lamar KX. Let's get out of here. Get the music back on. I guess we're heading to the direction of my house. Probably the best I do. Fuck it, why not? Versus 
sounding good when you listen to the car. Am I the only one to get that feel? You guys like what you're seeing so far? Hit that like button, that subscribe button. Hopefully we can make it back without running to the beach.
truck. I like that truck. Ah. We became lieutenant, so we're just here for five months. They brought us out here. We came from Colorado or whatever, bigger city. It's kind of small out here, so yeah, I was just hunting for a truck now. So I was like, let me get people's opinions because I don't want a really big one. I just. Yeah. I, I like the mid-sized trucks. Okay. Um, uh, do you know what the length to length on it is? Ooh, most, really... of them have, most of them, if they're the four doors, have a, have a five foot bed. Okay. Uh, you can get a Tacoma with the full four door and a six foot bed. Okay. Um, but the short cabs have six foot beds. Nice, nice. Because I, I want a really small one. Because I got just, uh, it's just me and my wife. And we live like, if you could drive all the way down the street where the house like yeah. right in the corner. Okay. We just moved in not too long ago, but yeah. yeah. I'd, go, uh, I'd go with, uh, I mean, if that's the case, if you really want to make sure to maximize the bed with it, mm -hmm. uh, get, a, get a short cab. Yes, sir. And long bed. So get that six foot bed. Short cab, but long bed. That makes sense. Yeah. Absolutely. Yeah. I uh, figured I actually, I didn't mean to bother you to take your time, but I saw your truck. I said, that truck looks pretty damn cool. So I was like, let me yeah, ask. It's a, it's a 2020. Nice. I got it right before the market went crazy. Insane. Like, it yeah. was starting the ramp up, but <laughs> yeah. Uh, so yeah, that's the downside. Is like just trying to get, just trying to find them. Yeah, exactly. Cause I had to fill my car up the other day and it cost me seventy three dollars. I'm like, I might as well get a truck now then. Yeah. Like if I got to pay that much. And that, well, that's the thing is a lot of guys are trading out from the bigger ones and going down. Mid Oh uh, so yeah, I got. Still need a truck, <laughs> but so yeah, it's a. Uh, it, there's nothing that's cheap out there, I can tell you that. But I like the Rangers. Okay. Um, I recommend them. Uh, gotcha. They, they do get the best fuel economy out of the segment. Nice. Short of uh, the, the Chevys with the diesels. Okay, Those yeah. Are super rare. Okay, gotcha, gotcha. Yeah, it, and now here, my wife told me that uh, one of her friends in the military, her unit, he said he got a truck, but it's a four cylinder. Yeah. I was like, really? That's what this is. It's a turbo, no. it's a turbo four cylinder, but it's okay. 270 horsepower. Nice. So you still got the power you need. Oh, yeah. Yeah, this Absolutely. is, uh, this will, uh, it's probably one of the fastest ones. Absolutely. Uh, for the, uh, for the size. Okay, yeah, I'm definitely going to look into it, but I'm going to get out your way, man. It was nice talking to you. Have a good one. You too. Have a good one. You too. Lamar KX. If you like what you saw, man, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button. And of course, I will catch you guys in the next video. Peace.